Happy Friday. Hey, yes. Happy Friday, even though this will be Sunday when everybody's watching it. Um, right. <laughs> okay, guys, just a quick video that we thought we'd um, uh, do for you because last week's 90 Day Fiance, I think I, I think I mentioned, like you and I talked about it, like Natalie looked pregnant when she was on that rock talking with her friend in Ukraine. She just looked a little thickums and her face looked a little fuller. So I wanted to know if she was pregnant. And then you went and did some research and you found a rather interesting article uh, from Screen Rant. And it's like 90 Day Fiance TLC viewers think Natalie was pregnant before rumored wedding. Right. Right. Yeah, it was just because it's like her weight gain was kind of stark. And it wasn't like a bad weight gain, but we mm -hmm. were comparing her from when we first saw her, even before she left Ukraine till now. Mm -hmm. And you can tell, like, you know, like her breasts are larger. Like, it looks like her hips have filled out a little bit. Her face has filled out. And I'm mm -hmm. like, this is not like a typical quarantine 15 or 30. This is like, this is all around. This is all around. Like, could mm -hmm. she be pregnant? Is this why she's like pushing this wedding so hard because she doesn't want to have a baby out of wedlock? Yes. Yeah, I didn't even think about that part because you know everybody has a baby out of wedlock, but she's super religious, or mm -hmm. she says she is. You know. Mm -hmm. So look, here's what some of the article says. Um, after watching the latest episode of 90 Day Fiance, many viewers are convinced Mike. Young Quiz fiance Natalie Mordoseva, whatever, got pregnant while filming the show before her rumored wedding with Mike. In the recent episode, Natalie seemed to show off a small baby bump and a bit of a weight gain. Some 90 Day Fiance theories earlier indicated that Mike and Natalie tied the knot in March slash April 2020 and then welcomed a baby. Now fans are convinced this wasn't a theory but a fact. Mm -hmm. I know they got married. I didn't know there was a baby. They kept that quiet. Right. They kept that real quiet. That's crazy. Okay. So many 90 day fiance viewers have noticed that Natalie and Mike don't agree on many things. They constantly fight about their true issues, their, their, their trust issues, sorry, lifestyle differences and religious beliefs. Still, they're staying together, hoping they might be able to work on their problems. Some theories suggest that they never got married and faked the marriage rumors to make their storyline more interesting. However, Nat Natalie's latest scene has banished a the theory from many fans. What? In the February 28th episode, Natalie talked to her Ukrainian friend on the phone about her relationship with Mike after explaining she is already 35. She says she is eager to get married and have a baby because she longs for a family. Well, that's true. Mm hmm Oh, yeah. She was definitely, like, that was one of her biggest things because, you know, I mean, she had, she had, she has two ex-husbands, right? Is it two? Yes. Yep. Two. I mean, she's got two ex-husbands, so she understands, like, you know, once you get that 35 mark, I guess, from what I understand, the biological clock starts ticking, you start thinking, like, oh, my gosh, my time is running out. And I, I can I can see that. I can definitely see that. And she's not trying to waste. She doesn't have the time to waste, basically, what she's saying. Like, she's like, I need mm -hmm. to make this work. I do love him. Um, I And she knows she knows that she can't always be right in order to get what she wants. Yeah. She under, she's, start, she's starting to get there. I'm like, finally, this is all we've been asking you for. Just apologize. Like, acknowledge his hurt feelings. And then, then you guys can move on. So mm -hmm. I was when she, when she did that, I was like, okay, cool, she's coming around. And then we started talking about the weight gain. I was like, is it possible that she's mm -hmm. pregnant? And then my thing is this. If she is pregnant or no, why not make it a part of their storyline? Because I would have found that much more interesting than her being aloof and angry all the time. Right. But I, I think they worked themselves into a corner because they gave them the storyline of always being fighting. Well, how are you fighting and you getting frisky at night? You see what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. you, you, Mike is just saying, you know, we're not in love. 
we um we don't even like each other like we can't see eye to eye we don't agree on anything if all of that is true how are y'all having sex exactly so they kind of work themselves into a corner i yeah you're right i think you're right on this one <laughs> like you know everything was preset so a baby was in with like lend us to believe like oh y'all really getting it in if you out here doing all this kind of stuff so they had to keep it going they had to mm -hmm. like keep it they couldn't let us in on this otherwise we're like oh my goodness like you we knew it well yeah 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 and then we just blown up the whole spot so i understand i just wish they would really let these couples let things play out like mm -hmm. yeah you know it would have been a better storyline right. i agree with it, you and then this is a, this would been a perfect extension of their previous season. Mm -hmm. I this would be a perfect progression. Like they just played this so wrong, in my yeah. in my opinion. Had they just let it play out, they would have gone from like you know, fighting on the last episode of the last season to like you know trying to make it work, and then trying to work their way through like this process and going over their issues and then they come up pregnant like this is a joyous thing i mean and then they could have probably brought the mom over sooner can you imagine how happy her mother would have been at the sight of <sighs> a little grandbaby she would have been clucking over him clucking over natalie and then when that baby was born oh lord it would have been the second coming of jesus it would have been amazing but they screwed it up they uh, I know mm -hmm. production companies feel like they know best and that they know what we as the viewing public wants. But in this case, they got it completely wrong because we don't completely want to knock down, drag out fight all the time. No, we want to see the natural progressions of these relationships because they're supposed to be real relationships. If they're, you know, filing correctly with the U S government, aren't they? Exactly. So, well, I'm glad that like, we pick up on this and I'm glad that like, we have some sort of confirmation. It's just sad to know, like, even more, like, TLC just can't let things go properly. They can't just let things play out. They have to manipulate things. It's like, come on now. Yeah. So, like, they, the article says the same thing that, that I talked about. Um, since her outfit was fairly tight, it was evident that she gained some weight, mostly in her stomach region. It came as a shock to many viewers because they just saw her skinnier self on the previous episode. Within one episode, Natalie was showing off a weight gain of a few pounds. While mm -hmm. the timeline of TLC filming is unclear, it still seemed like a drastic increase for the star. According to a Reddit thread, and many fans comments, Natalie was already pregnant in the scene. Right, and a, and a lot of people I've heard say like, this season is all chopped up and pieced Ooh. together. The timeline doesn't make any sense. The timeline is off. So this just lends credence to that. Mm -hmm. And you know, it's true. She has like a very healthy diet. She was physically fit. Yes. You know, she's trying to get Mike to lose weight. And look at look at how this picture looks. This is exactly what I was talking about. It was this image on the, the rock. On the rock. She was pushing out that guts. And look how full her, her breast area is. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Yeah, you 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 caught that right away. I just know I noticed it in another scene. It was what does she have on? Oh my god! One fan wrote, "She's it, definitely pregnant. That can't be carrot weight." <laughs> it had to be. It had to be. It had to be. I wonder if she's wearing that gray. The picture that we saw earlier was it thin? I kind of really know. I know she had gained weight in her face. I'm like, oh, okay. But then I saw the rest of her body. I'm like, oh. And now he wears mm -hmm. fitted stuff. So when she started wearing like this, this final shirt here or whatever, mm -hmm. that that's not her typical style of dress. No. So you could tell. But I'm happy for them. Um, once it's confirmed, I'll be happy for them. You know, it's just but I think we kind of can all see like she's pregnant. So this is it's I'm just glad we can pick up on these things a little bit faster than we used to. That's because we're like super jaded at all of these fake storylines. 
Well, that um, too, but I'll go with that. We're happy we're picking up on these things too after. <laughs> okay, so um, after this revelation, it looks like the couple was probably faking their explosive arguments. Fans now think they wanted to get married secretly and begin their family. And they didn't want to wait for the show to end, according to a fan. It's also possible that the true crime actress, Natalie, got pregnant and the couple felt compelled to get married. Whatever may be the case, 90 Day mm-hmm. Fiance fans are pretty excited to meet the duo's rumored baby. Yay. Whoa. Well, I'm happy. Yeah. I mean, she said from the beginning she wanted a, a marriage and she wanted a child. Right. Not too much so, to ask for. So she's getting she's gonna get to that and like i said i'm happy for her like when i always feel like if you just if this is something you want go get it make it happen and she's made it happen so kudos to mike and nally congratulations on the wedding and the baby congratulations as well mazel tov again this was an article that we picked up from screen rant um it was published two days ago uh let's see so that would be on the third of march Mm-hmm. And it's 90 Day Fiance TLC viewers think Natalie was pregnant before rumored wedding. I wonder All if they right. have a baby registry somewhere. Yeah, well, now I'm about to look that up too. <laughs> okay, guys, that was ripped from the headlines. Just a little something to give you something to ponder on over the weekend. Until next time. Bye. bye.